Hi friends, welcome to RK Broadcast. I would like to explain correlation analysis in this video. It is very important concept in the data mining and machine learning community. You can easily understand the concept with a simple solved example in this video. Let us see what exactly correlation analysis first. Correlation analysis is a statistical analysis. It is used to measure a, measure a relationship among two or more variables. Look at this equation in this. There are, there are two variables A and B. We will try to find out the relationship between the two variables A and B. So this simple equation is trying to find out the correlation analysis among these two variables. So let us understand clearly about this equation first. So here A is the attribute values. A dash is the mean of the attribute value. The mean of the attribute value is going to be calculated with the simple equation. A dash is equals to sigma A by N. Indicates the total values of A attribute divided by N. And similarly B attribute minus b dash b dash is indicated the same mean of the b divided by n minus 1 n indicates the how many number of tuples in that particular database that indicates n let us see that in clearly with an example and sigma a and sigma b these two are the standard deviation of a and standard deviation of b this is simple equation to find out the standard deviation sigma for example to find out the standard deviation for attribute a is equals to root over sigma a minus a dash whole square divided by n minus 1. So this is simple equation is able to find out the correlation analysis, right? Then what is the result equation is going to be provide? This equation is going to be provide. There are three possible values. Once you simplify that equation, that correlation coefficient might be provided the values between plus 1 and minus 1 range. So, for example, after simplify that equation, you may get positive value, positive value, it indicates that is a positive correlation, plus 1 indicates the positive correlation. So, what does it mean positive correlation? If attribute A value is increases, along with that attribute B also increases, that saying that value go, if the value goes up for one variable, the value goes up on the other variable also. For example, that equation provides zero. There is no correlation among two attributes. It indicates that two attributes are independent each other. Let us say that equation provides minus one is perfect and negative correlation. Indicates that if the value goes up of one variable, the values are goes down another variable. So, uh, so this is the way it is able to find out the analysis. So now let us observe the example. Uh, let us see the example to find a correlation analysis among attribute A and B. Example, you see this is the data set. We have taken attributes A and B. Uh, this is the student A score. This is the student B score just you can assume. Uh, let us see this is the correlation equation. We already have seen this uh, equation. So uh, now let us see um, how to find out this. So now let us, uh, with this example, first let us try to find out the A, A bar that is the uh, mean of the a so now a attribute contains the values are 20 uh, 12 plus 9 uh, divided by divided by 3 because there are three values this mean is going to be find out 13.66 once you simplify like similarly we are trying to find out the b bar that is the mean of the attribute b values so indicates 8 plus 34 plus 4 divided by 3 again is equals to its simplified value is 15.33 so from this equation we already calculated a dash p dash that is the mean value you know the a and b values now we are trying to find out the sigma a this is called a standard deviation value sigma a is equals to this equation is already we have seen uh, earlier it is going to find out sigma a minus a bar whole square divided by n minus 1. So we try to find out this by this a minus a value is now 20 minus a bar 13.66 whole square again 12 minus 13.66 whole square plus 9 minus 13.66 whole square divided by 2. 
So it is going to be simplify the standard deviation of A is equals to 5.68 after you simplify this. So like similarly, we need to find out standard deviation value of B is equals to same equation like instead of this sigma sorry b minus b bar whole square divided by n minus 1. So here you need to find out same like b minus 8 minus b bar value is 15.33 whole square plus another value 34 minus 15.33 whole square and the last value here is 4 plus 4 minus 15.33 whole square divided by here n, n indicates how many values are there there are 3 n minus 1 so now it value is 2 this is can be root over for all values this can be root over so now you can simplify this value you will get it 16.28 so now you know the a bar value b bar value standard deviation value of this is for a this is standard deviation value for b so now we are trying to simplify this above equation above equation as for that as for the correlation equation we are trying to simplify this b minus 13.66 because 13.66 is we calculated earlier the value into 8 minus this is the value of a attribute and b bar so 15.33 plus 12 minus this is a value 12 minus 13.66 into again b value 34 minus 15.33 plus 9 minus 13.66 into b value 4 minus 15.33 divided by we are saying that n minus 1 n is equal to 3 3 tuples so n minus 1 is 2 into we already calculated the standard deviation of a is 5.68 standard deviation of a 5.68 into standard deviation of b this one 16.28 16.28 so this is the correlation value substitution so now simplify this you will get minus 47.91 divided by 27.64 is equals to you will get minus 1 point something so we got a negative value so according to this if it is a negative value if it is a negative value you may get as for earlier discussion this is the negative correlation negative correlation indicates accordingly if one attribute value increases other attribute value decreases the same we have discussed look at this example of database a value increases b value decreases because there is a negative correlation here uh, most of the cases a value increases and b value decreases so here it is a small values there are three mostly it can contains a value increases correspondingly b value is decreases so this is indicated that there is a negative correlation among attribute so this is a simple example for you thank you